Welcome back to Nitty's Den Under. What a beautiful park for dogs, hey? Look how big it is. Isn't that a huge park? We're so lucky to have it in a small country rural township. But last yesterday I took my little man to the vet. He had his nails clipped. Um, he was weighed and it was not nice to see what his weight was. So um need to get him back out to go for more walks. It's gonna help me too, but not my foot. So this is beautiful, hey Bo? You like this? Isn't that lovely? He, he's actually, he's running around with no lead on. Look, see? No lead. He's quite good. He's, I've been trying to teach him if he goes wandering, if he knows where to come home again. Look at this big pine tree. Isn't that huge? Then you've got a dead one there. Because you know that dead plant tree though? If I came at night time, do you know that make a great photo with the, the background? It would. I just noticed as well, the teach, one of the teachers are out laying track markings for the kids to do their running. And it reminds me back of my days. Remember the old um, colour code cones? Look, I'll show you what I mean. So it gets the kids to tell them where to run. I'm going to show you one. I, I don't know this being back memories or not, boys. But it does me. I've seen these at football training as well for the kids. I don't know. I'll get a little bit more closer. Remember these when you were a kid? I do. And I still go these days for the kids. It's a good idea, actually, because there's no damage or anything can be done to them. Oh, and I'll show you what else they use. Look, they use the old red cones as well. They're good old traffic cones. Then. But let's keep on looking around. Bo, come on, love. Oh, look at this. This is a beautiful native. Australian native. When it gets going, going, they can grow really big. Yeah, you know, see these plants, see this flower here, this here. I don't know if you can see it or not. I remember these as kids, and they used to look like faces. But they've got these all everywhere here. Oh, look at this beautiful big native there. Well, we're quite lucky here in Australia because they give our animals more room to roam than just at home. Come on, Bo. Let's go. So I need to keep on calling him before the kids keep coming out. The other thing about this park, they actually have seats where you can actually sit and relax. So what I normally do, if I like to do something like that, I bring my, I bring um a travelling cup like this one. They make coffee in it, and it gives me something to drink on the way around with Bo. Look at the oval! Isn't that huge? I reckon the kids are going to be running around that. I'll show you one now. Wooden wooden seats that we have. Look at this. I'll keep on walking. Isn't that a beautiful tree? It's got a bit of green moss on it though. Look. Look at that. Pardon me. All the moss on that poor tree. Some of them will grow big and some of them will just starting to grow big. Like this one here. That one's starting to get bigger. Oh. And uh, this township that I moved into has a school, a few churches, a bakery, a chemist, an expensive little shop to do your shopping if you want to. What else does it have? Ah, oh, look at that. Isn't that beautiful to see? Um, they have an RSL club where you can go. There's motels, hotels, pubs, places where you can get your car fixed. You name it, little township all the time. This is interesting. I wonder what this is. Hmm. I wonder if it's a weed or what it is, or a ground cover being dropped by a bird, you know what. See the nice little seat? You just watch your dog run around, play, whatever it needs to do, eh? Ugh. Let's stand over some more. Look at this one. 
Let's go. Keep going up. I'll keep going up. Ah. Sorry about that. Okay. I'm going to start heading off this oval so the kids can do what they need to do and let them enjoy their fun day. It's actually, I know there's three chairs here. Ah, oh, Bo, are you enjoying your little walk through the park? I'm going to try and at least get two, two or three kilos off him before he sees the vets for his yearly injection. Yeah, they told me that he's got a bit of a pot. <laughs> nice way of putting it about his tummy, isn't it? He's got a little bit of a pot. I'm not worried over it. I still love him. So I have kept his, di his diet started since last night. He only gets about a hand and a half full of dry food at night. I'm going to be cutting his treats back big time. And I'm going to be cutting his bones back big time as well because that's what I need to do for him. And then um, I'll get him reweighed again and checked for um, his weight and see if I've got any off him. Hopefully I have. And that'd be good. Then the noise you can hear in the background is the school. Oops, sorry about babe lifting his legs at ya. Look at this beautiful tree. Isn't that beautiful? I'm a nature lover, everyone. I'm sorry to say. That's why you see a lot of beautiful nature photos. Because I love nature. Look at that. That's from an airplane. You wouldn't think it, eh? Anyway, I need to go because I know the school will be wanting the grounds in a minute and to make it more safer not to have Bo here with the kids as well. So if you like this video, please like, leave a comment, share with your friends, and I shall sweet talk with you all later. Bye.